After you've created your account and downloaded Evernote, you'll probably want to try creating your first note. The easiest way to do this is to go to New Note up in the taskbar and select the type of note you want to create. For simplicity, we'll use the New Note option. You can see it creates a new text note. You can then give the note a title and then type your text. As you can see, Evernote gives you several different options for formatting your note. You can bold or underline your text, create multi-level lists or outlines, add color to your text, create charts, add lines and add voice notes. Once you've created your first note, there are several things you can do with it. From the file menu, you can export it into a few different formats, attach files to it, or print it. If you click your secondary mouse button on the note, you'll see you can attach files, save attachments, add your note to the shortcuts menu so you can have easy access to it, and insert to-do list items and hyperlinks. If you click on the note preview in the All Notes column, you'll see you can create a new note, open a note, export it, save attachments, add the note to the shortcuts menu, copy the note link, share the note by email or on Facebook, LinkedIn, or Twitter. You can also delete it, copy it, or move it to a different notebook or add tags to it. Just one thing, you may have noticed present up in the note, up in the menu above the note, as well as in the menu that comes up when you click your secondary mouse button on the note, on the note preview. This feature allows you to turn your notes into presentations, which can be useful if you had to give a presentation to a group of people. However, it's only available to people who have Evernote Premium. That'll wrap it up for this video on creating your first note. In the next video, we'll talk about creating a notebook.